What's in the fucking box? <laughs> All right, John. This is gonna be the last one. Okay. This is our last video today because I got the COVID vaccine and everything seems to be going pretty good. I don't know if uh, you're planning on getting the vaccine. No, I have no idea about the vaccine. No, it's good. It's... We'll get test tested I, later. I feel a lot January. safer now that I've had. Safer. Now that I've had the uh, the vaccine. Um, so you know, I, we have I, never I, I encourage everybody to go get the vaccine. It's a quick prick, and uh, you're all done. Wow. He is a quick prick. Ha! All right, on to the we're video. Never masks. We're never wearing this masks. box came just like this, and it is from Zobi Productions. This is the Zobi Black Friday. Zobi XL Horror 2020 Black Friday. Um, so what they did on Black Friday was offered a limited edition amount of these XL Horror Boxes. This box contains only three autographed pictures or props. And it was only $125. All right. So I know, I know you, you often are... Uh, like concerned about the value of some of these items and whatnot so so uh, do you already know what this i don't is? this okay. is a total okay, mystery box that's what so I'm gonna say. All right. i did watch another youtuber that opened up their box and it was much thinner and he just got three uh pictures i think he got an 11 by 17 an 11 by 14 and an 8 by 10. so my this box seems a little wider so oh you know what he got a prop he, he got a uh, baseball bat Signed by Shelley Duvall. So That's actually, cool. that would be kind of cool from The Shining. Right. Um, I just so, like to have. I just. I just I think mean, if you're gonna. Away, it feels like it's more than just pictures. Money. Yeah. Could be. Could be packing paper. But if you're gonna invest the money in it, I just think you should get something of value yeah. for it because you're you're taking a risk at at any, at any one of these. But they really should give you. Make. So make I don't it think worth these it. were. Like I tried to go back to Zobi to uh, check the website out to look for more information um, because Black Friday is a haze. I just right. went on a like buying spree um, on all these different websites. I know I told you about that the next day. Um, so we will take a look. Um, so this could be pictures Let's or bang. props. Um, I'll take the paper out. Okay. I'm not looking. I just looked. Did you see what that was? I didn't completely see what it was. Alright, let's just pull it But out. now I do see sort of what it is. Should we wait and leave that for last? Um, I don't know. You can Go ahead and pick it. something You can probably it. take it. I'm going to let you do that. I'm, because, I'm honestly... Because he does... I'm you'll nervous. see what I'm saying when he, when, when he pulls out the one thing that he felt. I'll just pull out this. Okay? I'm nervous. I'm not going to lie. Oh! Uh. Uh, he is from American Horror Story. Okay. Um, I love that series. I cannot think of his name. I can't um, read it, so I will not even do it. You know who I it. thought it was at first was from the scary movie, <laughs> the the guy with the the funky hand who oh, tried okay. to do the mashed potatoes. That's who I thought it was at first. Um, but no, this is clearly um, the guy from American Horror Story, and uh, I don't I don't know what his name is. Um, I don't either. Do you know his name, Maggie? But I love no. American Horror Story, so no. I'm I'm very happy. Okay, so I'm not looking. Okay, I'm don't not look. Gonna, I'm gonna pull out. Oh, this is oh, a big one. Poking out. He's pulling out the big one. And I'm trying not to look, but I can feel what that was. So I feel like that's a a chunk of pop. like I felt it. So this is huge. What do we you think this is? Know. Eleven by seventeen. Should we show them? <laughs> What? Uh, uh, who? Uh, oh, the stuff! Wow, what a classic old cult favorite um, movie. So, have you ever seen this stuff? I don't know if I ever have. To be honest um, with you. It is a Larry Cohen film. It's a it's a horror comedy. The stuff. It's kind of like um, I don't want to say it's ice cream, but it's like that marshmallow fluff. And uh, I mean, Danny Aiello does a guest star. 
And then, let's see, Scott Bloom, Paul Servino. Is that, that looks like that might be Paul Servino. Um, wow. That's actually a pretty good. That's cool. Pretty this good is, autograph if it's Paul big. Servino. Yeah, yeah I Servino's think that's Paul dad. Servino. I think that's who it is. So, yeah, that, I think he's a great actor. So, I think if that is his, that's, it, that it's, that's pretty It's got to be good. Like, that's Paul, yeah. and that's The S. only other thing I was thinking was maybe if it was that Patrick O'Neill guy. Yeah, but, like, that but, looks like that might be the I. Yeah, it could the, be the uh, I, I, so. Paul uh, Sorino, if you're out there, call us. Let us know what it is. Yeah, hit me up you on know, Instagram. Hit, hit him up. We're, let, now it's dark. Let, let us know. Instagram. That's a huge uh, thing. So, okay, so $125. Was it worth it yet? Let's see what the last item is. Uh, is you're actually the guy that collects a lot of these. I have very few far. Okay, so it is a Funko Pop. It is a Funko Pop. So it's we're going to have to take it out of... A signed uh, Ari Lear, Lear uh, Jason, probably, or, oh, maybe Jeepers Creepers. I've seen those. Well, it's not any of the above. Okay. Now... I haven't seen this yet, so if you want to, like, do a role reversal and try to get okay. me clues... I'll do a roll reversal. Okay. I'm sweating right so now. This so this is bad. like one of my favorite movies. Okay. I'm sure Jim will mock me for it. Um, I'm going to go out on a limb right now and okay. say this, if this is legitimate, is probably well worth the money that you spent on the box. Really? Now, the people at home just saw what I did. Okay. So, in roll reversal, so this movie was... In the later 80s. Okay. Goonies. No. No, not the Goonies. This actor, we'll just say this actor, this character, yes. well known, has not done very many horror movies. Okay. In my opinion, in my life, since he did this one. Now, when he started this movie, when it started out, there was other actors and actresses in it that went on to be a little well-known as well. I, I can't think of their names right off the top of my head. Um, but it had a great cast. <laughs> had great cast. But I'm talking about some of the non-main characters in this. Okay, so I'll throw it out a little bit with you. Let's... I, I'm, I know you've seen this movie. You suck at I this. know you. I do suck at this. But this is my first time. Come on. And I'm awestruck that this is actually, if this is legit, this is a great freaking thing here. Okay. Uh -huh. So I'm a little flustered by that, right? I'm who, who would not be, who would not be like, holy shit. Because if you got, the only other one was if you got two of the other guys that were in this movie, two of the other main characters that okay. were in this vampire movie. So it's a vampire movie it's with a, a large vampire cat. movies. Is 80s. it Wesley Snipes? No, way better than Wesley Snipes. What? I'm sure I'll be called out by somebody about for this? that. Way better than Wesley Snipes. Okay, this so guy is a well-known actor, vampire? been in a lot of freaking oh, 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 oh. movies. Is it Roddy McDowell from Fright Night? Not nah, Roddy McDowell. Not even close. His father is also a well-known, established, famous actor. Ooh. Still living today. Still living today. His son, also well-known... Also, okay. very popular. Uh, okay. Did a re his most recent TV series that was quite popular had to do something with time. What? Time. The uh, actor time travel. Cool. The actor's most recent, in my opinion, you guys at home can I don't correct know me. I don't know TV. Well, it was a a series, sort of a political series. Wait a minute. It wasn't his most recent, but it was his more popular one. It okay. had to do with time. I'm just going to give you the clue is time. Okay. Not time travel. But Not time, time travel. It's okay. Time. I think I'm following you now. Okay. I think I'm following you now. I admit I'm horrible at this, but I'm flustered and I'm blown away okay. by this. So, if I'm blown away, you've got to be sweating bullets I'm by now. sweating bullets, and okay. I think I've got it from your very bad... Uh, Thank you. Uh, I should so see these all the time because I'm horrible at it. the Lost Boys... And it's um, Kiefer Sutherland. Yes. Shut your Bazinga. face. I don't even want to look because I yeah. think you're lying to me. I'm not lying. David is the <gasps> lead vampire what from the there. Heck? So. Oh Kiefer my Sutherland. God, John! Look at my arm. I you know see the little short yeah. hairs. 
<gasps> oh, this is. Re did you already show it? I did. Oh my god! I did when I was horribly trying to describe it, but in my mind, I totally saw it. What the heck? And it's certified. Yep. So, you were like freaking me out when you're like, "If this is legit, it's certified." <gasps> oh, I get a little you know, gun shy, but it's just, certified. That's why I that's just all I'm watched saying, guys. this. That's all I'm saying, guys. This, I, this is, is on, one of my um, favorite movies. This is on Shutter right now, playing yeah. on their I have it. I've movies. seen it several times. And the two Corys are in the it. Two Corys. Um, Jamie, uh, whatever her name yeah, is. Yeah, that's who she, I was trying to get Jamie at because Gatt, that was, Gatt, was in her first one. There's saxophone shirtless yes, guy. The saxophone shirtless guy. That's a the soundtrack is great. It was yep. Joel Schumacher's best film. Yep. Um, and then he went totally south with the uh, Batman, and. Uh, Wow, that's pretty so. Kiefer epic. Sutherland, Kiefer Sutherland, if real, because I'm a skeptic, signed this very Funko Pop. Yeah, his DNA is on this. He's, yeah, you could create your own Sheldon. You could create your own Kiefer Sutherland. Wow. Also in Young Guns, also in Twenty Four was the name of the series yep, I, that was quite I, popular. I, you know, you, I thought um, when you said time, I thought time travel, and I'm like, Whoa, right, yeah, I, I, I figured totally that lost. at point, like you were gonna think Doctor Who or some rogue time cop or something like that. So this is a 2018 Funko. <gasps> oh, I can't even handle that. Wow! Don't tell anybody where you live. My new co-host. Wow! I'm totally being eliminated from this. So. Check out my one channel, Nobody Cares, on YouTube, because that's going to be my thing. And yeah, This is epic. It is epic. This is probably one of the... Now do you see why I was so I, discombobulated I wanna, I wanna, when I was trying to tell you, you about it? Do you have a phone like right on you? Stuff it? Yeah, you want to watch. I don't like, go to... go. How do we even look up what the value of this would be? I mean, how many of them could there be? I, or, I wonder... Let's see what there is. What would you look? Do we just want to look for Kiefer Sutherland's autograph? Sure. Wow. Say, but... So anywhere from 150 to 300, we'll keep it short. All right. So anywhere from 150 to 300, um, I'd say that's pretty awesome. I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, that's gonna do it. I have to go change my underpants. About 150. I would I would say 150. So worth the price of the box. What did I say I pay for the box? 125. 125. So now you got that on Black Friday deal, which is a really good deal because yeah. that there alone makes the value of of the um what's even better is that it's a movie i love now see i didn't think you liked that oh my i gosh, thought you I mocked me one time on that well, I, I mock you I all like the time but I, yeah but, but i mock you behind your back sometimes a lot it's, actually a lot i love this movie like i literally just watched it this week because it's on shutter on the featured channels and rosemary's baby i watched rosemary's baby and then the lost boys all in a row two of my favorite movies Rosemary's Baby. It's a great. It's, have you ever seen it? Yeah. Oh, I love it, especially that that sexual tension, the sex scene, and the sex. Mia Farrow's never looked better. She's so adorable in that movie. All right, this is going way long. That's gonna do it, everybody. Thank you. I got nothing. You can't go wrong with now. It's dark. And a ghost will follow you home. <laughs> back. Hurry back. Be sure to bring your death certificate.